Shabab. Just look at this one. I use the new sensor with my new uh, unit transmitter and I have a reading. Okay, I will interchange it to the other one. The one which I reported which has a problem. Now it's connected. See what will be happen. <coughs> now it's connected, it's locked. And look what is happening to the transmitter. Then I check the diagnostic and look what is the reading. Sensor no communication, sensor initialization. Okay, let's wait till it's initialized and see what will be happen after. <coughs> it's not communicating at all and it is not initializing because this uh, sensor has a problem. Let's look on it. I will, re I will skip it. <coughs> skip. Then another skip. Then again diagnose. Okay, still no communications, okay? And the red alarm is blinking. And this one is coming an alarm also. This icon is not continually. Now, I have to remove it again. I remove the sensor. Okay. I put new sensor with it. And see what happened. The red alarm gun the sensor initialization started and I'll go for measurement <coughs> the, the reading comes back immediately again one more try what will I do now is I remove again the this sensor the one which is working and the new one, which are reportedly not working. Same thing. Okay. Just look what is the different. <coughs> no reading at all. I'll go for diagnostic. See. Now, sensor failure appear. And the same red alarm again activated. Then remove it again. Okay. Now connect it with the sensor. With another one which is working. And escape it. Escape it. Escape it. And diagnose if you notice there's no red alarm <coughs> and the diagnostic is active and the reading came back I'll go to the measure reading came back so this is confirm that the one I reportedly not working is confirmed dead or confirmed defective or failure